to them what's going on it's your girl raquel aka little cute nurse i'm back y'all with another video yes y'all like this hat me too girl me too this is miss dara that's how i'm gonna pronounce it looks like dara to me she's from the milk collection janet collections new milk collection and y'all i would definitely say this lace is definitely melting and a perfect match perfect match for my skin tone i am feeling myself in this hair if you can't tell from this huge smile i'm just saying how y'all been how y'all doing how you so still doing y'all i've been struggling but i had to get back and get in here and let you guys check out this video see this hair i know somebody wants to know what's on these soup coolers so let me just go ahead and tell you right now I um, got a couple things that were sent to me from Oprah. I mean, from uh, Oprah. I'm gonna say Oprah. I don't to say Oprah, but it's Oprah. Oprah Cosmetics and Octoly sent me over this really cute palette. This is the Oprah Glitch Glitter. Did I make that up? No, it's Glitch Palette. I added glitter. I'm gonna tell y'all why. Cause it's really pretty, even though. I'm going to admit, it's, it's really cute. The shades are cute. But pretty much all of them are um, shimmer shadows. So you're going to have to pull in another palette. Well, I, you don't have to. You probably could do all shimmer shades. But I used uh, this purple. This, I think, silver I went in with. And on top, I put this little pink shade. But I also used my Juvia's Place palette. Uh, the Tribe palette. On my bottom lash line. Let me get this open. Yeah. I use this shade down here. But I use this purple. Here. Yeah. I use this purple all over the lid. And then I went in with the shimmers on top. So yeah. If you just need a cool shimmer palette. To mix some other shades with. Or to just add shimmer and shine. Let me show y'all. Try this gold. This gold right here. It's just really, really beautiful. And the shine is so unreal. Let me get this green and show you. That's how it looks on my finger. And the swatch, I mean, these are just beautiful shimmery shades. I hadn't heard or seen of this palette, so I had to get it so I could share it with you guys. I just, now I want to see this blue. I'm doing too much. But this is the blue. I don't know if it looks blue because of the lighting, but it is blue. I'm just going to swatch that right there. These are some really pretty shimmery toppers. Or you could just really use one shimmer all over the lid. But y'all know I'm going to do too much every time. And they also sent this. Uh, this came as a set. This is the Lip Gloss BRB. I want to say be right back. I don't know. But it just says lip gloss BRB. And I know the really shimmery shiny that you see on my lips. That's what this is. Because the only thing I used was one of my baby bite beauty lip glosses. And this is just a. Let me show you. A very neutral looking shade. That's it right there. And on top of it. I put this BRB by Oprah Cosmetics. This is what it looks like in the package. I was like, oh, we I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. Let me put it right here. See, it's just a real glossy, it's got purple reflex in it. And I put it on top. And I was like, oh shy. See it. But then after a while it melted in and it was just so super shiny. It's not sticky. It's not heavy. I like it. I really like it. So, so glad to get these. And again, I got these sent over from Ofra. Oh, I forgot. Ofra also sent over this uh, green eyeliner, which is why I went with purple and green. If anybody wondering, this is a good eyeliner. Because I'm going to tell you, I put this on last night. Last night. This morning, before I got in the shower, I was drinking coffee. Well, let me play with that. This is what made me do this video today. Y'all see that? 
yeah. I put that, I was like, wow, that's green. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to get up and do it for else. My only day off from starting a new job, if y'all wondering where I've been. Yeah, three weeks of orientation and stressful. Not my own schedule, so I couldn't squeeze in recording. But I'm here. I'm here. So I'm not complaining. Thank you for that. But, and I put this on, I was like, ooh. Okay, I'm, okay, we're going to do a video today and we're going to talk about some stuff. Yeah, so this hair in this liner, and I had I wasn't too excited about this Ofra palette, but after I got to using it, I was like, this can be my topper. Whenever I want to put some glittery shades on, I can go to this on top of whatever that I got was matte and do it. So again, thank you very, very much to actually and Ofra Cosmetics because I am happy with this and I want some more of these because this is so so creamy. Y'all see that? And it stays. Stays in place. I want me a light blue, excuse me, a light blue, a dark blue, and a black. Because like I said, I took a shower and this didn't move. And y'all know how addicted I am to my boss milk makeup um pencil. But I really like this. So yeah anyway y'all wanna I'm going to quit talking so we can get into this video and y'all can see this hair because this hair here is so pretty. And I know I done talked enough. I'm going to quit talking and go and get into the video so y'all can check this hair out. And at the end of the video, y'all keep on watching because I'm going to have to give the winner for my little put together boxy charm box at the end. Alright, y'all stay blessed. See y'all later. Okay, guys, this is what the unit looks like in the package. How she comes. As we can already see, it's only going to be one of those units that you can, you know, has an invisible part. But this is how it says the unit, the melt lace compares to the regular lace. So we'll see. I'm going to have to get one of these in a 13 by 6. And again, this is Miss Dara. I think that's how you say her name. Let me shake it up. Looks like Daria. 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 That's what it looks like. So let's check out this melt lace unit. Now I really did like the uh, unit that I made from Jenny Collections. Melt lace. Um, wig kit. Where you design your own wig. If y'all didn't see that video, I will attach it probably in one of the cards up here so you guys can check her out so i decided to try one of the units i already like this lace color so far yeah okay this is what she looks like on the inside we got one comb in the back there are no combs in the front oh yeah they're right there at the part i'm sorry i almost lied and then we have two adjustable straps right here in the back. All right, let me get this off. Get rid of this hang tag. I don't want to be thinking I'm sexy with this hanging on nowhere, you know? Okay, it says she's Carolina safe. Oh, okay, up to 360 degrees. All right, Miss Dara. This is how she looks. See if I can't get her to look that good on moi. <laughs> All right, this hair is really, really soft. I got a piece of that that uh, hang tag plastic that I cut off stuck in there. Real soft. I like the waves. Oh yeah, and she is long. Look at that. I already got my curling irons heating up. This lace color looks like it's gonna be a good color too. Looks real good. Let me cut this lace off really quick and we can pop put on y'all. Ain't no sense in making a long drone video. Okay, I got the lace off. It's this really, really soft lace, which is good. Y'all, I've been working on getting my edges back healthy and just back here again. And uh, I usually don't anymore, to be honest, put on these... Uh, stocking caps I just use the little wig band try not to use stocking caps I've been using them so long but um, 
a friend of mine, Desi here on YouTube, was telling me that um, they seem to work pretty good at protecting her hair without this cap. But I've made it such a habit in putting on the cap that I have to. I'm trying not to, but I have to put on the cap. But we'll see. Edge is coming back. I'm liking the Hervetic uh, Henna. All the Aveda oils and treatments that I'm using. So, yeah. And I'm, I'm documenting so we can get to see an end result. I like this hair. I can't stop playing in it. Okay. Let's pop her on. I see what she look like. Definitely big head friendly. But if you got a lot of hair, I don't know. Because I don't have a lot of hair, but she clinging to my wig grip pretty good. Pretty good. Okay. The part could use a little plucking. Oh, I like this. I like this. This looks like a full lace unit. Now, I do see I'm going to have to. Can y'all see? Because I can see it on camera. Not so much in person. But I can see the knots and stuff around the perimeter really good. So, I'm going to take my mineral. What is this? Ruby Kisses Mineral Powder. I don't know what. It says Caramel is the one that I have. And I'm going to see, can I doctor on this lace a little bit? This is my weed control spray. I'm going to put some of this on here just to get me some natural looking life. I wish I knew what I did with the small bottle so I could put some over in there. It's a heavy bottle. Let me brush through these waves. I like this already. I do. And the main place I wanted this was in that part to get rid of that powder look. Yes. If you have not never ever 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 tried the African Pride Weed Control, it's the best. I'm telling you, it is the best. It won't make your hair hard. It it you know, it's the best net spray I have ever ever purchased, and I've been using it for a while. And I got this bottle to set my local beauty supply. You can find stuff pretty much anywhere. I think it's, I'm not going to say it because I have never gotten it in Walmart. This looks like a full lace human hair unit. I like this. A few little kinks down at the bottom. But I'm going to knock them on out. Probably from the waves. But this hair feels good. It don't feel like that um, plasticky, synthetic -y hair. This hair feels really, really good. Really good. This is my favorite little part. Yes, yes. I like this. And it's really long hair, so it's got to be good. Because y'all know I don't like really long, really long hair. Got my makeup in there a little bit. I like this. Let me let y'all see the back. Oh, I like this. I really like this hair. Knowing me, I'm going to weigh her down a little bit more. Because I don't like bushy hair, big bush hair. If I did, this would be perfect. This unit, you know what this reminds me of? The way, what is her, Andrea Renee here on YouTube wears her um, weaves. This is what exactly what this reminds me of. I had to think of somebody who likes this big bushy hair. 
and even though hers is a sew-in this looks a lot like it a lot like it let me turn around so y'all can see the back but y'all see how long it is this is about where it falls on me just a little bit below yeah the boob tubes okay let me turn around so y'all can see the back This is really beautiful. This is beautiful. This is Miss Dara. Oh, I like her. I really, really like her. I got my irons here heated up because I thought I was going to need to lay her flat. But there are no flyaways. And she already laying just like I want her. I'm just doing this. I'm going to be honest. I am just doing this. There is no need. There is no need. Oh, she is beautiful. It just feels like a, a full lace uh, human hair unit. That's that's the look and the feel that it's giving me. Okay, y'all. This is it. There is no need in me making this video longer than it has to be. But, uh, yeah. I think I'm going to go ahead. I got to do my video. Another video today. So, I'm excited about doing it. Because I, 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 this hair has got me... I want them all. I think it's three or four different versions. I want them all. This is so, so beautiful and so natural. Okay, guys, this is it. This is the end of this video. I'm not going to keep on talking, saying the same things over. I'm sorry because I know I did it about three times, but this is Miss Dara in a 1B. I don't think that would be appropriate for my skin tone, but I like this 1B. And I want to get the other two. I will let you guys know and keep you updated if, in fact, I do. Before we end the video, let me jump in here real quick and say the winner of my boxy charm giveaway box with all the stuff, you know, that I kind of stuffed and poked in here. Let's give a big shout out and congratulations to Miss Ricky Gray. If you see this video, I'm going to give you all week. So try to get a friend. Shoot me an email. My email will be listed down below as it is. I think it is. Or just send me a message. DM me, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. It don't matter. However you send me a message. Send me your address, girl. And I will get this to you on my next off day. And congratulations. But anyway, the Melt Collection. Miss Dara from Janet Collection. Alright guys, I will talk to y'all later. Stay blessed. And I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.